I'm on an adventure. Six foot crocodile in Ontario, Canada. I need to see it to believe it. Let's go. Here's the first creature we're looking at. Um, this is a female. This is my wife's pride and joy. Um, so pretty. It's generally night bedtime for her, so she puts herself to bed, but I'll see if I can get her to come out for a quail egg. Oh, what's that, sweetie? So pretty. Oh, look at that. That is cool. Oh, wow. Now, the camera doesn't really do it just. How many feet do you think she is there? She's uh, about three feet. Oh. And I'm sorry, I, you might have said, what would you say she was again? It's an Argentine red tegu. Red tegu. Beautiful. Oh, there we go. It's like, hey, you tricked me. Yeah, her uh, her eggs is always her treat. Those and are that the quail, quail eggs. Egg, yeah. Quail eggs, yes. I'm going to try Better? Yep. Come on, sweetheart. Oh, look at you, pretty girl. Okay. Beautiful. Yes, you're beautiful. All right. I gotta... Her name is Matilda. Matilda, eh? Yeah. Look at now she's like, you got more, Dad? She's one of her, one of all of our animals are rescues. So beautiful. No, you're not coming out of the cage. Mm -hmm. No, you're not coming out. Yeah, we got more to see there, sweetheart. Yeah. And what do you feed her predominantly, like mostly like eggs uh, and... She eats a little bit of everything. I make my own mash food for her. Okay. Uh, it's all prey animals, meats, fish, um, bone matter, everything all ground up. And they uh, they end up looking, they're little meatballs, but it's like a meat mash. Any fruits or vegetables? Well, she or... loves her fruit. She loves her grapes and blueberries. Oh, interesting. We just try not to give her too many because of sugar content. You're saying she's really nice and shiny right now because she just shed? She just had a shed. Yeah. They usually look their best. Yeah. Look at you, sweetheart. He's a uh, what? That's an African pixie frog. It's a male. Well, that thing's about as well, probably bigger in my hand. I got skinny little yeah. fingers. I'll see if I can pick them up. Or get them to move. But hands comparison. There's my hand. He's a predator eater. He eats oh, yeah. like everything. Kind of like the Pac-Man? Yes. Yeah, I figured. All right, buddy. On to the next. Is this a male or a female caiman? Uh, I believe she's a female. Is it okay if I kind of... Yep. All right. We're going to get you guys a shot. I've got to climb in here a little bit. Hopefully she doesn't go underwater. Oh, look at her. There she is. Steady my hand on the log. Beautiful. And what does she eat mostly? She eats a lot of fish. Uh, I feed her fish, small rodents, uh, pieces of meat, chickens, quails. I'm sure you lose fish periodically. Actually, the goby challenge. That's who ate all the gobies. Oh, yeah, that's right, too. That's where all the gobies are going, too. She's cool. Yeah, I'll get the turtles and fish fighting a little bit here. This might entice her. What kind of turtles are those? Red ear sliders. Oh, okay. There's two males and a female in here. This is one of the little males. This guy here is actually, he was in a school for 22 years and the teacher uh, retired and we, she gave him to us. That's cool. Oh, we got they it. They took the liver. You got it. I can see him. 
Here he comes. Yeah, no, Ned's not coming over. That's the big female there. She actually laid eggs for us this year. Oh, wow. My wife named her. You don't run and hide, sweetheart. It's okay. Come on, girl. Come here. Like, who's this guy? It's unreal. She's like, more dad? Yeah. She eats small stuff. She doesn't like the big items. Mm. When she gets a big item, she brings it in her pond, and then I got to dig it out. I love this part. I still love this part every time. She's really cool. I got one more piece out for her. Oh, she's hungry. Here, I'll see if I can get her to come up a bit. We're in the process of building a 10 by 12 enclosure in the house with an 8 by 8 pool in it. Nice for like for winter? Yes. Yeah, it goes, it's a nice size. You got a big pond, uh, one of those pond layers eh, in there. Yeah. Nice. Next year, this the pond's going to be double the size. The outdoor enclosure is going to be double the size as well. And in case I had the camera off, you were saying that she, uh, you're feeding her pork right now? Yep. She eats a little bit of everything, whatever I raise on the farm here. Nice. Not too picky? No. I had to get up here to see this. I don't think I've ever seen an alligator in Ontario. We got a couple of flies in there, sweetheart. I don't feed her live animals either. It's always frozen thawed. That's cool. Well, that's smart too, because I just teaches her not to necessarily be going for live things. Yep. Cat accidentally gets in, whatever she gets out. So cool. Oh, look at. Oh, oh. I'm sorry, sweetie. That's interesting. She's trying to eat you guys. Go down here. Awesome. Come look inside. Oh, that's a cool shot. Straight down the throat. All that pork's gone. Man, that's so cool. I just need David, David Attenborough's voice in the background right now <laughs> telling me some details about. Oh, oh, sweetheart. <laughs> Allie, 
you sweet. She's not anim an animal to under uh, under respect either. Uh, yeah, no, absolutely. It's like uh, you guys saw me touch all the other stuff. That's because I'm pretty confident. I've been around some big snakes and big stuff, all because of this guy over here, Perry. But uh, obviously, I've never been around this before, so I'm not going to play around. I don't know if the mic can pick it up or not. Just a couple of hisses here and there. That's so cool. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed this little video. Chances are a couple creatures you've never seen. I know I've definitely never seen an alligator in Ontario. And that uh, monitor again, or what was it again? Tegu. Tegu monitor, yeah. She was so beautiful. All right, guys. Leave a comment down below what you guys think. Maybe we'll come out again next year, see the progress. So in the comment section, let me know. Have you guys ever seen anything like this up close and personal without going a trip to Florida? Let's go. See the sun shining from the windows. Okay. I know that today will be a good day. Okay. I know that today will be a good day. A, B, C. One, two, three. Drink some water. Brush my teeth, get out of bed and I stretch Bed in my hair is a mess Look through my clothes for a fit Anything I do is dress